Good afternoon, welcome to Berwick Mitsubishi. My name's Steve and today I'm doing a walk around video presentation for you of this fantastic 2015 Mazda 3 Max. As you see in a little hatchback, I'll go through some of the features for you. I'll go through the detail of the exterior of the car and the interior to give you a really good idea of what you're looking at today. And as you'll see in the cherry red, really does stand out nicely on the road. So I'll just turn the camera around for you. And as we go turning around, you'll see, as I said, right from the start, really nice presenting car in that red. Really makes the chrome trim around the front grille there and the Mazda badge really pop there for you. You can see we've got really good headlights on the car. We also have our fog lamps down the bottom with our indicators just above them. Now, part of the great thing about this little car is it is still running a two litre four cylinder engine. So it's um, giving you plenty of power for the little car, but also producing a fantastic fuel economy of only 5.8 litres as the average combined fuel radio, uh, sorry, ratio. Uh, so getting us around nearly 880 kilometres per tank load of fuel on average. So having a look at the bonnet here, we do have a few minor little stone chips in the front here. I can see one just on a bonnet there. But overall, from what I can see in this light, it's really good condition. No major dents or anything, that's certain. And then as we come around the front bar, you'll see really good condition still flowing right through. Fantastic looking alloy wheels on this little car. Uh, so we do have the Mazda badge in the middle of them. Color coded mirrors, which is really nice to see. And then having a look as we go down the exterior of the passenger side, so far really good there are a couple of minor little marks just there but overall looking down the whole side really good and then having a look at that chrome trim right along the front our indicators are integrated into the mirror which is sorry just down here uh, which is really nice to see and i'll open the doors and go through the interior at the same time as we come through so being the little mazda 3 we have our embroidered floor mats there, so really nice condition. The carpets look good. Even the seats are in great condition there. As you can see, nice cup holders in the middle. We do have our heating and cooling controls in the center there, our nice big uh, display there, which is, all, is controlled via the little dial down here, or you can actually touch the screen still. So you got the best of both worlds there. Having a look at the interior the door trim uh, very good there no concerns at all and then having a look once again at the interior there you'll see with the driver side there as well really good condition just reaching across there to give you a good look the Speakers in the door, carpet, floor mats in great nick there too. No marks on the backs of the driver or passenger seat, which is really nice to see. And then come back out and while we're down, we'll have a look at the rear alloy rim in really good condition as well. No major marks or anything there, so that's another bonus. And then coming around, as I said, overall, the condition of this vehicle presents really, really well. We do have a couple of minor little marks uh, at the back there. Uh, that one. Nothing major though. And now I'll open the back up for you. Uh, give me a moment. The button hiding up underneath next to the camera there. And then as you can see, once you open up, cargo uh, cover is still there for the parcel shelf. And then a nice big boot space in the back here for a little car. Plenty of room in here. We've got a couple of little uh, spots on the side where we can put stuff down. We will have our spare wheel underneath and it is just a space saver. Nicely tucked away with all your tools, everything you need there in case of a breakdown. And we do have child anchor points in the back of the seat. And the good thing is the rear seats are a 60-40 split as well. 
so you've got plenty of room. And closing the tailgate, so you can see quite nicely styled. We do have our high mount stop lamp at the top, which is really good just for safety purposes. Uh, Colour coded reverse sensors on the rear bar, as well as our reflectors down lower. And then coming around further to the driver's side, you can see overall condition so far looking very good. With only a couple of minor marks around the car, it is overall really good condition vehicle. Open the driver's door for you to have a look at the driver's side. Now this is where we see most wear and tear. And looking at the seat in great condition there, right through. No marks or anything up there. And then you can see we do have all our controls on our steering wheel as well. So driver's side we've got all the cruise control. On the passenger side we've got our phone yeah, and stereo controls there, which is nice. And then our dash, nicely styled there. Indicators and headlight switch. Now we do have eye stop on this one there for you, so you can turn that on and off, which is a nice little feature on these cars if you're doing a lot of city driving. Once again, overall, really good condition, even the driver's door, which is where you normally see most of the wear and tear you'll see on these sorts of areas. No major marks or anything there, which is really nice to see. Stepping back so you can see the whole door. Really good. And then back around. So four great tyres on the car. We do have good condition alloy wheels. I think this is the first one I've seen. Just a minor brush mark on there. Otherwise, all of the other alloys, I didn't see any marks on them, which is really good. And then the roof line is in great condition as well. So as you can see, this little walk around video presentation for you of our 2015 Mazda Max 3, uh, sorry, Mazda 3 Max. Uh, really good car, presents very well. If you've got any other questions about the vehicle or you'd like to organise a test drive, please give our staff a call here at Berwick Mitsubishi and we'll be more than happy to assist.